The Queen Women Champion Chase is next. Uh, this is the second of the big, big championship races of the week. It's for the two miners. Grade one, of course. And at the top, we've got Adrenaline from Leon Van Rensburg, Alphine Hideaway, Craig Allen, Kate Frank, Darren Thompson, Lord Gail Martin, then with Spice Mott, David Robertson, the King, the Joshua Southern, Up and Atom, Paul Rhodes, Viking Flagship, John Morgan, Alien Invasion, Leon Van Rensburg, Asavia Jr., David Robertson, Cash's Queen, David Hooley, Flockton Green, Darren Thompson, Lucina Stalina, Craig Beckwith, Ozark, Zetkin, Vinnie Gerard, Relative Rose, Craig Allen, Runaway Lady, John Morgan, The Smiler, Joshua Sutherland, and to the stars, David Hooley, 18 of them then in this big field for this, and away they go. I often get this many in the Queen Mother, so this should be a good one as they get to their first. And over it they go, one or two mistakes already right down on its nose was uh, Cape Frank for Darren Thompson. But they're already quite well strung out as they get to the second. And the leader, Runaway Lady, is almost running away there. But look at this, three greys bursting through to take first, second and third at the moment. And two of them are John Morgan, flashy grey front runners. It's, it's Runaway Lady and Viking Flagship who are the first two from Lucina Stalina is now settled into third as the third of the greys just dropped into the pack over the third fence they go and they all got over that one nicely and we're already through the first half mile of the race they get over the fourth that'll be the final fence next time round and Cash is Queen has gone so there'll be no cash for David Hooley from that one in this one although he's still got to the stars running for him in this so they are not racing uphill then there and then they'll swing left-handed they take this fence on the way out to the back straight and over that one they all go slow jump at the back by adrenaline quite surprising to see a leon van rensburg horse struggling to go the pace right out the back but they are going pretty quick and it's runaway lady in the lead from viking flagship four length gap then to the smiler is in third relative rose just being pushed along there in fourth as they get over the next on the inside of that one was flocked and green then ozark zetkin in is also there as well and Lord Gale's quite close up as well on the outside with Alphine Hideaway and up and Atom as they skip over the water and over the water they all go all safely over the water with Runaway Lady in the lead just on the inside of Viking Flagship. The Smiler, he looks like he's interested in joining them as they get over that big ditch and over that one they go and Adrenaline's gone so one of Leon's is out as well now. Lucina Stalina also seems to be struggling at the back and that one's probably going to pull up the leaders. Both made mistakes so too did Lord Gale. The Cena Stalina has indeed been pulled up but his Viking flagship who's setting this tremendous pace they're already into the final seven furlongs and it's Viking flagship in the lead runaway lady is second the smiler is third then flocked and green after that one they call to this final ditch over that one they go and they're all over that one okay they've got just three more fences to take then now in the queen of the champion chase and it's Viking flagship and runaway lady being chased by alien invasion then comes the smiler then on the inside flocked and green up and atom is making a forward move then relative rosa a big gap to the rest of them are all going to struggle to get into this but are these leaders going to tie up as they come to the final three fences it's runaway lady in front viking flagship in second over a third last they all get over it well and there's a faller at the back there though asavia june is gone and runaway lady is in the lead and runaway lady kicks on viking flagship suddenly starts to tire alien invasion moves into second but it's runaway lady in the lead here comes alien invasion the smile is thrown out a big chance so too flocked and green then the king and then open at a relative rose Ozark Zekin, Lord Gale and Alphine Hideaway. There's plenty of chances now as they swing into the straight with two to jump. And Alien Invasion has taken the lead. Alien Invasion, Viking flagship coming back for more, but Alien Invasion is clear. There's a fall there, the smile has gone. It's Alien Invasion down to the final fence, gets over it nicely. He's five lengths clear. Alien Invasion, five lengths clear of Ozark Zekin. Inside the final furlong, and Alien Invasion is well clear now. And it's going to take a spaceship landing on the winning post to stop this one winning. Alien Invasion is going to take the Green Mother Champion. Champion chase and racing up towards the line. It's Alien Invasion that takes it. Those arms that can second. The King is third. Then up on Atom and Relative Rosen Viking flashing flocked in green. And all the way back to Spice Mott, who maybe didn't even get a mention in the race. They went lickety split from the outset. And the two John Morgan horses cut each other's throats, I think, set it up for Alien Invasion, so it's a big race win for Leon Van Rensburg. Alien Invasion for Leon the winner. Ozark Zetkin for Vinnie Gerard second. The King for Joshua Sutherland was third. Up and Atom, Paul Rhodes fourth. And Relative Rose for Craig Allen was fifth. And I'm going to now hand you over to Stu, who's going to take you through the final two races on day one of the Cheltenham Festival. <laughs> 